right guys, so today's currently December 20th. And as you could see, there's Santa Claus here. There's a bunch of little posts everywhere. And as the time comes, they're gonna put more stuff. So I'm gonna keep showing you guys this time and keep showing you guys everything they put up and how Christmas is here in Mexico. So let's go walk around. Qué bonito. So here's Santa's house. Tiene un montón de arcos. Mira esto, el edificio todo lleno y luego el árbol allá. This is the government building that they have here. And then behind here is actually the church. And right here they're putting all these different things. That's a, the cool part about Mexico. They really overdo it for Christmas. Christmas is huge here in Mexico. Santa Claus and all that. Such an awesome place to be, guys. Look at this tree right here. Yeah, and do you see that? That logo right there is the professional basketball team here in Chihuahua. And the tree is beautiful. It's <laughs> like they're going to be patrocinating. Look at the arco. Oh, how beautiful. Ah, qué hermoso. Se bien bonito. The vibes here during Christmas are amazing. It's great. And then right there, el taller de Santa. Santa's workshop. Sponsored by Coca-Cola. <laughs> wow, look at this over here. <laughs> Vive la Navidad. En sé que te tenía que decir, viva la Navidad en familia. Guys, look at that. This is to take pictures. Look at these arcs, guys. Look at all this stuff. I seriously wish they did this in the US, guys. Wow. Y luego mira, ahí está el nacimiento. Aquí está el nacimiento. Aquí donde pusieron también lo de... No, Día de los Muertos, ¿no? Ajá, Día de los Muertos. Sí, ajá. Aquí es donde pusieron el nacimiento. Look at that. ¿Qué es eso? La casita de Jengibre. ¿De qué? De Jengibre. Como la galleta Jengibre de Shrek. Así. Ahí viene. Like, la galletita. La que, Shrek. Ajá, la que dice. No, no, mira, tú no es de la mitad. Ahí vive. Oh. <laughs> in Chihuahua, guys, they don't do it as big as they do in other states, like Mexico City, Guadalajara, places like that. So just imagine how Mexico City or Guadalajara look right now. Look at this, guys. So this right here is the... Nacimiento. Oh, so por eso no está. Ajá. Se pone hasta el 24. Net. Porque es cuando nace. So, por eso no está Jesús. Por... Y ya el 24 van a poner a Jesús ahí, ¿verdad? Oh, qué chido. So, mira, pusieron fotos de gente discapacitados de Chihuahua. That's something that I learned about here in, in Chihuahua specifically. They help a lot of people that are disabled. Mai, actually, she just went and she gave clothes to a disabled lady that needed clothes. And Anai took her some gifts for Christmas. So they actually help a lot of the people that are disabled here in Chihuahua. Yajaira. De la O Valdez. O Valdez. Paralysis cerebral. Oh my god. And look at her, guys. She's an engineer and she's overcome it. And look at that. That's really cool. They're giving all these people the credit that they deserve. It's inspiring to everyone, including us. We were just talking about this. We have had an opportunity here in Mexico to do something that millions of people would love to have. And we just want to take advantage of it because we know that not everyone has the same opportunities, guys. And this is a really big, inspiring part. Be inspired to be able to continue going on, guys. Really cool. Mira estos árboles. Se ven como de jengibre. <laughs> I'm sorry about the quality of the camera. I don't know why. I think because I use it so much to film these videos for you guys. I think there's a problem with the light intake because as you could see, a lot of the lights, they have lines and that barely started happening. The videos used to be crisp. I'm sorry about, about the quality. I, I, it's not the best. Let's go look at the posts that they have over here because they have a lot of posts from all over the country, guys. So let's go look at what kind of stuff they have and what kind of stuff they sell. No, no, así no. Con eso figuro no. 
ya si tenía otra figura sí se lo ponía, pero con, con eso no. Creo que se podría estar muriendo de frío y no se lo pone. No, oh, mira, dos gringas. Yo quiero dos gringas. Ah, no te creas. Alright guys, we're coming to the other side now because over there there wasn't a lot. So now we're coming on this side. Let's see what they have over here. A lot of the food, guys. ¿Qué es tacos de al pastor? Alright guys, so I guess we're gonna get some tacos, but we're gonna go walk around first and see where we get them from. Alright guys, so this side is mostly food, which is really it looks really tasty and I'm hungry, so I think I'm gonna have to get some food real quick. We're gonna get some of those tacos, some tacos al pastor. It's really crazy how they make them. These tacos actually come from Lebanon. There was a lot of Lebanese immigrants that came to Mexico and they brought that along with them. And now it's part of the Mexican culture and they call it tacos al pastor. So guys, I got a buñuelo and then we got a fresh donut, guys. They're making these donuts fresh right there it's super warm guys i can't wait to taste it but first we're gonna eat the tacos and then we'll show you guys when we eat these and we'll let you know how they taste oh. all right guys we're gonna sit down we're gonna eat the tacos and then we're gonna eat these so we'll show you guys once we eat these Pero lo primero. Está rica? freshly made donut it's nice and warm still oh it's delicious I will say it is a little bit gummy, but I have to say it's probably because it's freshly made. Oh, so tell me who you love, baby. Take a moment to unwind, face yourself and realign yourself with the world, baby. Check this out, guys. Look at this. They just put this in. It says Christmas in my city. And then look at this. Oh. No pude ir, fui al doctor. Ahí, en toda esta calle, Ajá. partes de lo que utilizaron para la obra de teatro. Oh, y, y estaba y en la pusieron? casa de la abuelita. Oso, oh, ¿tú viste eso en el vivo? <risa> oh, qué loco. Ahora eres parte de la... De la abuelita de la obra. Ajá. ¿Sí me puedo subir? Look at this, guys. It feels so weird. It's really cool, though. I'm in, a, I'm in my house, but as you can see around, we're playing outside. <laughs> really cool and like Anai said they use this for the play the one that i was supposed to go to we went to try to get the tickets like five times and then finally we got them and i wasn't able to go because i had to go to el paso look at that <laughs> check this out guys this is a train and i guess this was for like the play look there's wires so it's just empty it smells kind of weird in here too <laughs> This thing is huge. As I've said before, I'm five foot nine inches. And look at this. There's some beautiful pieces of art here. And I guess this was used for the actual play that they made. And, they, and because they're done with it, they're done with the actual play. They put it right here in the middle of downtown. And now you can see it right here. Look at that, guys. Check that out. That's amazing. <laughs> All right, guys, so look at this. This is a Ferris wheel. This is the, the actual thing. They have little horses. They have little carriages. This thing is actually beautiful. Look at that. It has pieces of art. Looks like Italy right there. Wow looks beautiful look at that as you can see there's a huge line as always they got a sponsor they got a sponsor for this year's halloween guy i mean <laughs> for this year's christmas i wouldn't doubt it if coca-cola paid for that tree <laughs> look this is a government building they don't do it like they do it down south guys in guadalajara the government building is filled with lights it's beautiful oh look they stopped the post with the little baby but look at this over here guys this is where the little girl told me hi and i didn't see her I felt so bad. I, I wanted to go in it, but there's so many people, guys. There's 
lines wrapped around the corner here. There's just too many people. Guys, I actually thought that the ice skating rink was in this building, but it's not. It's actually next to it. So we're gonna go see it right now. Let's go. Look, guys, they even they even have they even have the ambulance ready <laughs> for whoever falls because someone will fall. telling me it's just about 80 pesos or like four bucks to go in i kind of want to do it guys but the thing is there's a ton of people in there so we would just be squished so i think we're, what we're gonna do is that we're gonna come another day we're gonna come earlier because right now it's gonna be nine o'clock so we're gonna get here earlier and we're gonna try to get here when there's not so many people so that way we could film and we could just spend a good time together we're not gonna do it today but a video will be coming of us going in there and anai falling in there all right guys so <laughs> after all that time we're finally going home honestly we had a great time the visuals were beautiful everything here in the centro guys is amazing i 100 percent recommend that you guys come to mexico during christmas time because it was amazing so yeah guys this is the end of today we're gonna go rest because tomorrow we have to come to work again it's already nine o'clock and tomorrow we have to get here early thank you guys so much for watching as always we appreciate you guys so much i hope you guys have an awesome blessed day god bless